Praise the Lord, saints, and I hear restored, restored, restored. We created a write the vision checklist for our nation to be restored back to godly values. And I hear that reminder, situations are about to change soon. Change suddenly. Watch and see what I do. Watch and see what God says. Watch and see what he does and what comes to pass. We'll keep listening out for Father God. I'm going to keep this really brief. When my mom was going through her cancer treatments, and she's healed now, praise God, we created a checklist. And we didn't realize that this is what is, you know, the Bible teaches in the scripture, write the vision, make it plain. You're actually saying, Lord God, this is what I want you to complete. Lord God, this is what I need help with. And my mom had some major things on her list. She had, she wanted her IV poured out, her feeding tube. She had a lot of huge things. Um, she had scars on her neck and in her mouth from radiation. She wanted all that healed. She wanted the metal taste out of her mouth so she could taste food again. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Sure enough, God answered all of her prayers. Everything that she needed, she was able to check off of her list. So what we want to do as we go before God, because we know God is on the throne, and he's been saying, write the vision, because he is faithful and he's loving. What we put together is just a couple of bullet points, but also make up your own list what you need God to help you with for you and your family. You know your specific needs and so does God. And that's why this is so important because this is that moment when you can sit down with Father God and say, Lord, this is what I need help with. For with God, all things are possible. So here's what we have on our list. Number one, remove those Joe Biden terrorist demons. Number two, God's military help coming in to restore law and order. Number three, landlord support and relief efforts. Number four, restore us, Lord. Restore our nation back to godly values. And we want President Trump restored. And we want God's will to be done on earth as it is in heaven. God's glory and help here, miracles, signs, and wonders. How about that for number five? Number six, all that was stolen, restored. Uh, what does the scripture say? The thief must repay seven times. Number seven, celebrations on the streets, because we know that's coming. But we want him to do exceedingly abundantly above. We want him to enlarge our tents and widen Hikarabush, our territories. And then number eight, we're leaving that there for your prayer requests. But we're praying that, that all those prayer requests will be answered. Trust confidently in God and remember no weapon that is formed against us shall be able to prosper. Lord God, we glorify you. Restore us back to you, Father God. One nation under God, with our American flags flying high, where we're not afraid to celebrate that we're a patriot or that we love Israel and the Jews. Help us, Lord God. The thief may steal no more. And I remember you said, all that they stole, you will restore. And we give you the highest praise and all of the glory. Thank you, Lord God. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ, by God's authority, we pray. Amen. We want God here. We want his help here. And we want his vision for us too. Lord God, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven, we pray. Amen.